Hello students. Today we are going to start first session of class 11th chapter number 1 sets. Let us move towards uh, what is uh, set. Let us start with the definition of the sets. Sets is a well defined collection of distinct objects that is all the all the collections are not sets but set is a collection. Well defined. Now what do you mean by well defined? A collection is said to be well defined if it is possible to say clearly that a particular object belongs to it or does not belong to it. Okay. For example, uh, if you take a natural number less than 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So the numbers, you can uh, immediately identify that it belongs to that group. Okay. So uh, let us see some examples. These are two examples uh, are uh, of sets, the collection of natural number less than 20. Just now I told you that uh, less than 10. And the next one is collection of vowels in English alphabets. And uh, some collections are not set. Okay, let us see those examples. Uh, the following collections are not set. <clears throat> collection of bright students in a class. Why? Because the bright student, the it depends, uh, um, it differ from person to person. So if I will say a student whose mark is above ninety percent, so that is specified that you can identify that uh, you can identify the particular students that he is uh, uh, he scored more than ninety percent mark. Similarly, the second one is collection of beautiful people is not a set because it depend it it also differ person to uh, person. Okay. Now let us move towards the next uh, uh, slide. That is, uh, these are the few examples of uh, sets. The capital N denotes the set of all natural numbers. Capital Z it denotes the set of all integers. Capital Q denotes the set of all rational numbers. R, R capital R denotes the set of real numbers. Z plus denotes the set of positive integers. Z minus denotes the set of negative integers. Q plus the set of positive rational numbers and if you use q minus that will be the set of negative rational numbers and r plus the set of positive real numbers if you take r minus that would be the set of negative real numbers okay so uh, let us move towards the next topic that is the elements of a set all the members which belongs to a particular set are the elements of that particular set it is denoted by a Greek letter, okay, this uh, Greek letter and uh, if we will put one cross mark, it denotes, uh, uh, does not belongs to in the same uh, Greek letter, okay. So, for example, let A is a set of vowels in English alphabets. So, vowels, it contains uh, five elements A, E, I, O, U. So, A belongs to capital A, but whereas B is does not belongs to capital A. Okay, so now we are going to move towards the, our next uh, section that is very important section representation of sets. So sets can be uh, represented in two ways. Sets can be represented in two ways. The first way is roster form and it is also known as tabular form. In this, uh, a set is described by listing the elements separated by commas in a double bracket or braces. That is, uh, it is given on the screen. And uh, now see, just now I told you one example as a set of natural number less than 10. So if I will list out the numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So in that bracket, then that would be uh, the set in roster form. Okay. Uh, I will give one example. A set of natural numbers less than 6. Uh, just now I told you the set of natural number less than 10. Let us take a set of all natural number less than uh, 6. So roster form will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay. Is that clear? Oh, okay. Now we will move towards the another representation that is set builder form. <clears throat> In this, if all the elements possess some common property, so we can write the set using that common property. Uh, you see the left hand side that roster form. Uh, just we have seen 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Now these all numbers belongs to the common property that a set of natural number less than 6 
a set of natural number less than or equal to 5. So we can write uh, uh, it in the uh, um, set builder form. So this method of writing the set is the set builder form for describing a set. Let us see one example. A is equal to 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. So all are even, in, even numbers, multiple of 2. So how will you write? So we can write a set of all even number less than set of all even natural number less than or equals to 10 or less than 12. Okay. So uh, these are the two representation of sets. Now let us move towards the first exercise. We are going to solve the first exercise. First question. Which of the following are sets justify your answer? The collection of all the months of a year beginning with the letter J. So here uh, the beginning with the letter J is uh, well defined. We can easily identify that uh, the month of the June, month of uh, uh, month uh, start from Z, uh, J letter that we can easily identify. Okay, so that is why this is a uh, collection. This collection is set. Now let us move towards the second question. The collection of 10 most talented writers of India. Again, for talented writers, uh, it depends. It depends person to person. The, the criteria is not fixed. So that is why this is not a, a set. Okay. Now let us move towards uh, the third bit. Third bit is uh, a team of 11 best cricket batsmen of the world. So again here, the best cricket batsmen, the criteria is differ from a uh, person to person. So again, uh, we cannot find uh, uh, that uh, it belongs to that group. So again, this is not a set. Now let us move towards the next uh, uh, bit, the collection of all boys in your class. Suppose in a class, 10 boys are there. So you can identi easily identify the uh, boys of that particular class. So this is a set. Is that clear? Okay. Now the collection of all natural numbers less than 100. This also you can easily identify because 1 to 99 all numbers are belongs to uh, less than 100. So this is also a set. Now next a collection of novels written by the writer Munshi Premchand. So again whatever the novels uh, written by Munshi Premchand that also you can easily identify and if we collect all those novels then that will uh, um, that will be a set okay so next the collection of all even integers yes you can also identify the even integers whatever num integers you will take you can identify so this is also a set the collection of questions in this chapter so all the questions whatever the questions belongs to this chapter also you can easily identify so this is also a set now the last one the collection of most dangerous animals of the world again uh, the animals the criteria for dangerous animals it is vary from animal to animal so again this is not a, a set so these are the uh, nine bits in question number one now let us move towards the question number two so a set a is given 1 2 3 4 5 6 and we have to insert the appropriate symbol in the blank space so just we have to identify whether the element belongs to uh, that particular set or not okay so first uh, uh, question is uh, uh, first bit uh, 5 see it is clearly uh, visible that uh, 5 is belongs to a okay the second is 8 8 is not there so it does not belongs to a 0 0 is also not there so 0 is also does not belongs to capital a 4 4 is there so 4 belongs to a 2 is also there so 2 belongs to a and uh, the last bit that is 10 10 is not there so 10 does not belongs to a so this is question number 2 now let us move the question number three write the following sets in roster form now see these are all written in the set builder form and what we have to do we have to write all these uh, 
sets in roster form the first bit uh, the first bit is a x says that x is an integer and minus 3 less than x less than 7 so in between this interval we have to identify the integers so what are they minus 2 minus 1 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 okay and the second bit uh, x is a natural number less than 6 so 1 2 3 4 5 and c x is a two digit natural number such that the sum of its digit is 8 the first uh, number is 17 1 plus 7 is 8 the second one is 26 35 44 53 62 and uh, then 71 the last number is 80 80 and the uh, next one is x is a prime number which is divisor of 60 so 235 the other number is also a divisor but that is not a prime number uh, the la second last bit that is fifth bit is trigonometry the set of all letters so t r i g o n again o we have already taken so we should not take o then m e t we have taken r also we have taken the last one is y similarly the last one is b e t r because t e we have already taken so these are the answers uh, for the, the question number three now let us move towards the question number four write the following sets in the set builder form so first bit is uh, three six nine twelve uh, these are all the multiple of three so we can write the first four multiple of three or multiple of three less than 15 or multiple of three less than or equal to 12 uh, we can write in this way also x such that x is equals to 3 into m where m is a natural number and m m or you can take small n also n is a natural number n is less than or equals to 4 okay uh, the next one is 2 4 8 16 32 so these are the uh, all powers of 2 2 to the power 1 2 to the power 2 2 to the power 3 so we can write x such that x is equals to 2 to the power n where n is a n belongs to natural number and n is less than or equal to 5 or n is less than 6 the third bit is 5 25 again this is also power of 5 so 5 to the x such that x is equals to 5 to the power n where n belongs to uh, natural number and the value of n is less than or equals to 4 or less than 5 the next one is 2, 4, 6, so on. So, so on means it will go on. And uh, it is all an even number. So, set of even number. The next one is, uh, or we can write in this way also. X says that X is equals to 2N, where N belongs to natural number. Okay. The next one is 1, 4, 9. These are all uh, square numbers. Okay. So, these are all square numbers. So, we can write X says that X is equals to n square where n belongs to natural number and n is less than less than or equals to 10 or less than 11 okay so let us uh, see the answers these are the answers you can note down by clicking the uh, pause button okay now let us move towards the uh, question that is question number five list all the elements of the following sets that means we have to write in again roster form okay so first one is x is an odd natural number so odd natural number again uh, this will go so on 1 3 7 9 uh, 1 3 5 7 9 11 so on the next one is x is an integer it will lies between minus 1 by 2 less than x less than 9 by 2 so uh, the first one is 0 then 1 2 3 4 uh, x is an integer x square is less than equals to 4 so minus 1 plus minus 1 plus minus 2 and 0 so how will you write minus 2 minus 1 0 1 2 the fourth bit is uh, x such that x is a letter in the word loyal so how many letters are there four letters only four different distinct letters l o y a and uh, the next one is x is a month of here not having 31 days so you have to identify uh, the month which has uh, which have no not uh, 31 days that is the first one is february april like that you have to identify the last one is uh, x is a constant uh, consonant in the english alphabet which precedes k okay these are the answers 
okay you can note down uh, note it down by uh, clicking the uh, press uh, pause button now we will move towards the sixth question match each of the set on the left in the roster form with the same set on the right uh, described in set builder form so one two three six so if we see carefully in right hand side the c bit x is a natural number and div divisor of six and the second bit is two three two three is a prime number the, the, num, uh, the first one the prime number and a divisor of six m a t h e i c s so this is the, uh, the last one x is a letter of the word mathematics one three five seven nine x is an odd natural number less than 10 okay so this is a uh, uh, we have completed the first exercise and uh, that's all uh, for today's session we will start the second session uh, with a new exercise okay so thank you thank you very much